Thursday. And now there's a big old know. music coming to town. <laughs> Fall for Greenville, y'all. It is just a couple months away. So, who is headlining this year? We always want to know. The music lineup was just released over the weekend, and it's full of up-and-coming artists. Jennifer Martin has the roundup on the music scene tonight. It's one of the largest free food and music festivals in the southeast. And this year, Fall for Greenville has over 70 musicians coming to the stage. I'm looking for the up-and-comers that haven't hit that commercial, um, uh, commercially successful point yet. And then also I use the festival to get these bands a lot of exposure. It all starts Thursday, October 12th with Whiskey Myers, a country band from Texas who hit number one on the iTunes country chart with their album Early Morning Shakes. They've been touring a lot over the past couple of years, um, really making a name for themselves, and I was really lucky and happy to be able to grab them for the festival. Strong, like a river rolling strong. Headlining on Friday is Will Hoke, a Grammy-nominated songwriter from Nashville who's sure to bring in a huge crowd. I think Will Hoke is going to be the one everybody's going to be the most excited for. He was an artist that we had a long time ago, almost a decade ago, and he's made a huge name for himself since. Saturday's headliner is J. Roddy Walston and The Business. Known for their energetic live shows and Walston's piano-pounding style, their music has appeared in a Coors Light commercial and HBO's series Eastbound and Down. And if you're a fan of bands like Alabama Shakes, don't miss The New Respects, who were just featured in Rolling Stone as one of 10 new artists you need to know. Baby. Don't you want to go? Even though acts are coming from as far as Australia, there are still 40 local musicians, ranging from Mac Arnold to the Dead 27s to South Carolina's Stoplight Observations. With free admission, it's a chance to see up and comers before they hit it big, so you can stay ahead of what's hot on the music scene. Getting to hear these bands before they get to where they're playing arena shows and they're having to pay a bunch of money, they can come out here and see them for free. For Scene, I'm Jennifer Martin. Excited about that. I can't wait to see Will Hogue. If you haven't seen him, you definitely want to mark your calendars for that. Fall for Greenville is October 12th through the 15th. A headliner for Sunday night is still to be announced, so stay tuned for that. And sweet Kylie Odetta. She's going to be playing yeah, as well. Yeah, lots of great They're local artists going to be sweet. playing out there. we got all kind of good Ella talent. Ella Hennessy from the other day. She'll be there as well. Young, young musicians. But I love it. There's 40 locals, so <laughs> amazing. Free. If yeah, it's free, it's for just, me. Just right out here. Lots of food, too. <laughs>